Hallo und willkommen zurück, meine lieben Freunde. Ich bin's, euer Odo. Wir sind zurück bei Disco Elysium. Und dieses Mal mit einer mit einer um, Jubiläumssendung. Und die Folge Disco Elysium. Ähm, <lacht> mal haben wir das Fischerdorf uns fertig angeschaut und wir haben jetzt Typen gefunden und ich bin mir ziemlich sicher, dass es der Kryptozoologe und sein nice no Kollege ist. Not out of this gem. Okay, der klingt etwas anders als ich dachte. There's a cylinder on the ground in which the man is arranging some netting. It looks like some kind of trap. He notices you. Who's there? Oh, the police. Hello, officers. Okay. Is that the police? Why are the police here? The group of fascists. Interesting. Don't worry, Gary. I'll handle it. Immoral, the cryptozoology. To what do I owe the pleasure? That's sarcasm. He takes no pleasure from your appearance. Oh, seine Frau war so nett. Nina sent me. She's been really worried about you and is waiting for you to get back. You don't seem too happy to see the RCM. Oh no, it's all right. I'm just busy. What's this about? Okay, Nina said me. Of course. Thank you for passing along the message. That damn water lock is broken, and we can't go all the way around the 881. Yeah, that was me. I broke the water lock with my motor carriage, but it's fixed now. I can go back. The lo water lock's been fixed. It was fine when I crossed it. Yeah, we have a oh, the whole story. We should really be getting back. Gary could use a hot shower and a warm bid. <laughs> Did he say we can go back now? Yeah. Yes, Gary. We can go soon. If you see Lena, tell her I won't be long. Mm -hmm. Sir, your wife is waiting for you. Mm -hmm. I just have to do one more round. See if the phasmid has taken the bait. Then we're going. Okay. For all his passion, this man is diligent and patient. You could learn things from him. Könnt ich das? Ich habe nachgeschaut. Ja, das heißt Willenskraft. Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm looking for a subject. Have you seen a woman with red hair who seemed to be on the run? Tell me about this fast you're looking for. Hmm. Well. First of all, it's damn difficult to find, which is why we've been knee-deep in the reeds laying traps for it. Mm-hmm. What makes it so... Good question. Fine. Being a phasmid of the order Phantasmodea, a ghost insect, it disguises itself as plant matter. In this case, the reeds. Mm -hmm. Awful lot of reeds around, aren't there? Yeah. And I suspect it may have also developed other specialized techniques to protect mm. itself from predators or scientists in our present case. Mm -hmm. What's my hypothesis that it has evolved certain electrochemical defenses that allow it to interfere with animal perception, okay. impeding pattern recognition, confusing the visual <laughs> cortex. But I cannot describe how these defenses work, much less how they evolved, without studying a live specimen. Okay. Yes, it makes perfect sense. You're beginning to suspect there's something parametral about this phasmid. Nein, es gibt sie einfach nicht. Is this I'm expecting it to be quite giant. One known species of phasmid, called the Megaphasmodea zoensis, it's about the size of a grown man's forearm, so... Uh... Um, yeah. 
Why are you so interested in this stick bug? Aren't there more sensation animal there? Typical rookie assumption. Insects are much more sophisticated creatures than those unversed in zoology give them credit for. <laughs> yep. Even simply catching a glimpse of the insulindian phasmid would be the apex of my, of any cryptozoology's career. But to study it and its defenses, find out how it stayed hidden so long. Okay. That would be glory itself. Thank you, electrochemistry, for the meldung. We need you. Have you discovered about it so far? Very little, I'm sorry to say. No one's ever captured a specimen, so all our information is based on first and third hand accounts. First and third hand? So no one's ever found one. Not yet. That's what makes it a cryptid. <laughs> <clears throat> Just out of curiosity, if there's no proof of its existence, how do you know it's real? Gute Frage, Kim. I know it's real. Mm, yeah. It's clear that his obsession with the phasmid is driven by something more than the pure pursuit of scientific advancement. Ich wurde ausgedacht von anderen Zoologen. By which I mean, I've heard enough first-hand accounts to believe quite firmly that the Insulindian phasmid is more than mere superstition. Nina said there has been a sighting of it here in Martinet. Maybe the Insulindian phasmid has died out. Yes, the most recent sighting was by a couple of teenagers along the coast here. That's what brought us to Martin A's specifically. Okay. It's the first credible sighting in several decades. Admittedly, it's an unusual location for this species, but with all the sewage runoff upstream, it probably doesn't matter much anymore. Mm-hmm. Maybe the Indian phasmid has died out. I have to resist the thought. Such an extraordinary creature is doubtlessly highly resilient. After all, it's generally thought to be capable of parthenogenesis. Parthenogenesis? What is parthenogenesis? He means asexual reproduction. Oh. The females of the species don't need to mate to produce viable eggs. This okay. makes it easier for a species with a small population to survive. Danke, Enzyklopädie, dass du mir das erklärt hast. Irgendwoher hatte ich das, das uh, irgendwo in meinem Hinterkopf war das Wort schon mal. That's pretty clever. Females reproduce without males. A travesty, a crime against passion and common sense. This arouses no special feelings in me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the Insulindian Phasmid is a very clever insect. That's why it's so damn difficult to catch. But as a scientist, I'll try my best to remain dispassionate. Yeah, tell me more about these tricks. Well, they may not look impressive, but Lena designed them quite cleverly. So I'm sure they'll do the trick. Lena designed the traps? Yes. Okay. How do the traps work? Simple. Attracted by the locusts, the phasmid crawls down the funnel and, having eaten its fill, can't get back out. Okay. At least, that's the intention. The net isn't a perfect solution, but we didn't want to use anything that might damage the specimen's delicate exoskeleton. <laughs> Natürlich. What are you using as a bait? Locusts. Nearly all known phasmids are herbivores, of course. But we've hypothesized that the Insulindian phasmid might occasionally prey on other insects. Natürlich, weil die anderen alle Pflanzenfresser sind, frisst das jetzt. Inside the traps, a number of locusts crawl and tumble over one another in a tiny, chittering swarm. Okay. A meat-eating stick insect. Does it pretend to be the reeds as part of its ambush behavior? This seems unlikely. Thank you, logic. 
a carnivorous Thank insect. you for your opinion. We have also included plant material in the traps to satiate your skepticism. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of skepticism, this one. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> what will you do if these traps don't work? They'll work, I assure you. The predatory hypothesis, using Locus as bait, accounts for the failure of previous efforts by other teams, which use plants. We have given this some thought. Uh huh. The traps do seem to be deftly and thoughtfully constructed. It's clear the cryptozoologist's wife knows what she's doing. To me, this team and uh, often they let me ask you about something yes. else. Yes. What? Mm. And I'm eager to return to her, I assure you. But I can't leave before we finish with these traps. Okay. My wife understands that just as well as anyone. Okay. Come on, Morel. We've been soaking out here for days. It's time to go back. And leave the traps? Absolutely not. I won't let Lena down. Come okay. on. She wants us back. I'm soaked up to my nuts over here. We'll both catch weed crabs if we don't dry out soon. Okay. Don't let Lena down. Sounds like the cryptozoologist's wife shares a special connection to the phasmid somehow. Okay. I didn't know the phasmid was so important to of me. Of course it's important to her. She's seen it. A verified sighting, on record. One of only 40 century, and it's hers. Really? She sighted the phasmid? She didn't tell me that. Yes. That's how we first came to know one another, in fact. But that's her story to tell, not mine. <laughs> Needless to say, you must ask her about the mysterious phasmid. Ja, natürlich müssen wir sie danach fragen, als ob wir nicht schon genügend andere Sachen zu tun hätten. Diese, diese Geschichte geht, äh, gerät langsam außer Kontrolle, wie viele Dinge wir verfolgen. Wir machen nichts für den Mordfall. Okay, maybe you could go back to the whirling, warm up, come back to check the traps later? No, no, no. The traps need to be monitored on a regular schedule. What would we do if the Fairsmith were to starve while we were sitting tea at the hostel? He's dead set on this. Mm. Hmm, I could go for some trap setting. What if we check the trap? You? I didn't expect you to take such an interest in our work here, officer. Cryptozoology and detective work are very similar. Chaos is my method. I'm its scion. <laughs> we are looking for someone hiding on this very coast. Looking for another thing may lead us to her. Why not? At least it will give us the excuse to look into a lot of reeds. <laughs> <laughs> that it will. That it absolutely will. I hope you brought your good boots. Yep, we have große neue Schuhe. <laughs> Where are these traps? There are four in total. One is to the south, on this little peninsula. By the boathouses there. It's very near. Another we set in Land's End, to the northeast. It's behind a small sand dune there. Mm -hmm. On your way to the old radio tower, after the church. Die finde ich nie. The third is set near the canal, where you crossed, by a concrete slab. Okay, das könnte ich finden. A big thicket of reeds going up the slope, and among them... He gestures to the trap. You should check at least one of those before returning to this one, since I just said it. This one's more of a technicality, but still, better safe and stupid than sorry. What do I do if there's a fast mid in one of the traps? Bring it to me at once. Just make sure the trap is closed tight. 
Okay. He's not comfortable with the possibility that you'll claim the find, but he's lying about this even to himself. Okay, what if I encounter the Phasmid in the wild? That's highly unlikely, officer. But in the event you do, I'll spray you with a pheromone mixture I developed. Okay. It's made of musk and research chemicals. The pheromone should attract the insect to you, or at least prevent it from bolting at the sight of you. It's quite potent. Will last you about a week. Uh, I don't need thick that's your arm. I don't want this. Thank you very much. Okay. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, all in. Yeah, my experience gained. Dafür, dass wir den Pheromon gemisch angesprüht gekriegt haben. With the odd smelling spray, double helping as you bend your other armpit, and then gives you a satisfied nod. This is the smell of dying reeds, of longing crumbling into the water. Okay. I hope you're not buying this. It dispenses it without letting you touch the canister, so it would be precious like holy water. So it would be precious. No more. I hope you're not buying this. Dispenses it without letting you touch the canister, so it would be precious. Like holy water. Ah. It is precious. A single dose cost me 50 real to develop. Not that I expect you to understand self-financing one's own research. Yeah, natürlich nicht. Mm, what? Uh, I'm ready. Let's. Right. Which means you two can pack up and go back to the whirling. Whatever he thinks about this detour, it's clear that these men are exhausted and in need of assistance. Mm. Finally. Someone's talking sense. Thank you for your help. Gary Not and really. I will start breaking down camp. If you have any more questions, <laughs> now's the time to ask. We'll be gone once you get to it. If it's more cryptid related business you want to discuss, you'll have time for that later too. Yeah. But what if the information is vital on the hunt? Okay, then find it says dust. I'm afraid not, officer. I've been busy digging around in the reeds for days, looking for signs of insect activity. I'm less interested in mammalian concerns, <laughs> to be perfectly honest. Oh God, uh, Morel. The lieutenant takes a short note in his notebook, then gestures for you to proceed. I'll get going. Wollen wir den Gary auch noch mal ansprechen? Hello, I'm Gary. Very generous of you to help us out, officer. Mhm. Mm ich bin mir nicht ganz Gentleman. sicher, ob ich dich mag. I mean, officer. Ah, uh, ja, ich jetzt mag ich ihn noch weniger. The lieutenant raises his eyebrows slightly and takes out his notebook. Yellow man. Interesting. This is something to ask him about after a little probing first. I'm just waiting for my friend Morel to finish up with his insect traps so we can return to civilization. Okay, deswegen has the crypto fascist, Thailand fascist. <laughs> Not the love of the great outdoors. Yeah, I'm more of a city boy too. I like nature, just not this bloody coast. It's mostly drunks and degenerates that come here. Okay. Degenerates, this man respects authority too much to see the truth inscribed upon thine own visage. Pretend thou art the paragon of virtue. Was? Wie soll ich das machen? Hast du mich gesehen, Lama? Schau dir das Gesicht an. Ich kann nicht so tun, als wäre ich ein paragon of virtue. <lacht> ich bin, ich schaue fast offener aus als der, ah, als, als... Der Typ, für den ich die Jacke suche. I'm need of those. I can assure you. I'm a by the books, clean as a whistle of the, of the law. I'm not even tempted to touch intoxicants. <laughs> no, so sehen wir aus. Degenerates. I've been trained to identify the slightest hint of 
degeneracy. Preeminent authority on it. Drunks and degenerates, that's my clue. <laughs> Sadly, I think I might be a drunk or a degenerate. Maybe even both. No, perfect. I'm sure you've been tempted to drink. Nein, nein. Wir nehmen natürlich das zweite. Das ist das absolut perfekte. Oh, uh, I didn't mean it in any scientific way. Ah, ja, natürlich nicht. Do you know anything about the man hanged behind the boarding in rags? Oh, so that's what the RCM in Martinez is about. Great. Great to hear someone's finally taking care of that. Is this so this? you do know something about it? No, no. Nothing. He was some kind of mercenary. But everyone here knows that. I'm just glad to hear you're looking into it. That's all. He didn't kill him or anything. But there's something going on here. Uh, is this your mark? Ah, uh, in the case of things. Biologist, zoologist too. No, no. I help Morel with research sometimes, and I've learned some things along the way. But I don't usually go in for picnics like this on my own. Okay. You were surprised to see him. Uh, ah, we're fragging the mug first. My mug? Why would you think that? You said yellow man. That's not something many people go around saying. Seems as if you were calling it to, uh, calling to it longingly when you cried, "Yellow man, I can see, you recognize it. It's in your eyes. You look like the kind of guy who might have a collection of mugs like this, home in his colonial mug collection." Ooh. Heißt das, der Typ wohnt dort unten? Das kann schon sein. Ist er dann defensive und sagt uns gar nichts mehr, wenn wir das machen? How do you mean? Forgive me, officer, but we've only just met. He is trying to avoid lying to you outright. In case you really have been to his apartment. Yeah, we were in his apartment when the Senate was. All right, I believe you. You look like the kind of man who knows it's a crime to lie to an officer. You're acting kind of suspicious. Did I mention the mug was found at the scene of a lynching? Hmm. Now we're in the Senate. Okay, okay. I admit it. I threw the mug away in the trash container behind the hostel. I know I shouldn't have, and I am very sorry, officer. Oh. We wissen jetzt, wem das mug gehört hat. Das heißt, er hat vielleicht was gesehen. You're not going to find me, are you? I am. Rip out the fine slip for 20 real. 100 real. For 250 real, the maximum. Nah, Gary, I just want information. War gut, dass wir in den Keller runter sind, sonst hätten wir das nicht gewusst. Hm. Whew. Thank you. You won't regret this. Ja, I doch, werde ich. I won't use another man's property to dump my garbage ever again. I don't know what got into me, really. Work has been stressful lately. Damn Koiko's price dumping us out of competition. Uh, was? What did you do, Gary? Gar nichts. Nothing. Nothing. Just answering some questions. Helping out the law. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Start pumping that sweet info. Electrochemistry. Ich bin mir nicht sicher, ob die Hinweise, die du mir gibst, in irgendeiner Weise sinnvoll sind. How did you get into the trash container? Gary, did you put the clothes of a murder victim? The man who was hanged behind the whirling in tracks the crash container? 
How did you get the trash container? I know a guy who works with the trash collection services, CS Municipal. He gave me a master key for the trash containers of Martinez. Ooh, die hätte ich gerne. Wie dem Müllwühlen. Why would you need to get into everyone's so I trash? I can use the Whirling's trash compactor to store my own stuff. Garbage disposal is expensive as hell. The damn Bohemians run it like a mob. Yes. I'm sorry, okay? I thought I could cut costs. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have disgraced myself. Mm -hmm. Du bist eine Schande für deine Rasse, könnte man beinahe sagen. Disgraced? No need for the histrionic, sir. It was, after all, just a trash container. He studies his reaction. Gary doesn't answer. <laughs> Gary, did you put the clothes of the murder victim, the man who has, who was hanged behind the burning in rags, into the trash container? Officer, please, let me explain. It's not like that. Nicht? I was only cleaning up. I live right across the yard from where he was hanged, and I saw him stripped naked. All the clothes lying around in the yard, smelling. People are animals, you know? Yes, yes, what happened? Okay, then what happened? Was ist die bessere Option here? Yes, yes, what happened? Okay. Okay, then. Then I came out to clean up the rags because no one else would. I put them into the Whirling's trash, along with a broken mug, admittedly. Okay. Okay. I was coming to throw the mug away, and, well, I threw the mug there and the clothes too. Okay. Right. It was just civic duty. <laughs> exactly. That's exactly what it was. Civic duty. Mm. As he shifts uncomfortably, a series of clicks, like the clinking of glass beads, against one another as they roll across a hardwood floor. You've heard this sound before, but where? As he shifts a series of clicks. <gasps> er hat einen Teil der Rüstung. What's that strange sound? You wouldn't know anything about the victim's missing armor, would you? Armor? No. I, I mean, yes. Of course. I know he was wearing armor. But I don't know anything about it. Oh, du hast tatsächlich einen Teil der Armor an. Das an gibt's ja wohl nicht. See, he's not telling the truth. But he's too scared to admit more wrongdoing. What's that strange noise? What sound? That's clicking, I just heard it removed. Don't mess with me, I think you know what I'm talking about. I haven't the slightest. There's lots of weird stuff out here in the reeds, though. Insects, trash. Could be the wind shifting some garbage nearby. Er hat sicher den Teil der Rüstung an. Welchen Teil? Die Stiefel hatte ja der, der Ding an. Und es schaut nicht so aus, als hätte er den oberen Teil an. Vielleicht hat er Handschuhe an, aber die hätte ich ja wohl gesehen. Every day the wind shifts the reeds and whatever was left in them. Tambourines and condom wrappers, plastic and glass bottles, the smell of decay. Okay, ich kann wirklich nicht weiter fragen in diese Richtung. Vielleicht habe ich keinen Erfolg gehabt dafür. I hope I can help your investigation in my small way. Hmm. Does this mean you were in his apartment, admiring his colonial mug collection? Perhaps it would be interesting to tell him he was surprised to see my comic so gary you live nearby in an apartment in martinez why is he shifting around like that analyze gary's composure we fragen noch weiter sure danach. do officer his eyes narrow slightly he's wondering where this is going have you found your door open lately? Nein, wie sollte er? Er war ja nicht daheim in der Zwischenzeit. And you're a big man from Yeldal fan. How? 
the color drains from his face. <laughs> Mr. Everett Clare thought it necessary to unlock your apartment. I saw the poster in your apartment, you know, I'm a Yale, Do Yale Dollar Man fan myself. Time up. Puh. Ja, ah, ich weiß nicht. Das mit dem Everett will ich ihm auf keinen Fall sagen. Das interessiert mich nicht. Ich will die möglichst nicht in der Schuld von dem Depp von Everett. Ich will ihm aber auch nicht sagen, dass ich ein Fan bin. Er soll Angst vor mir haben. Bin mir nicht sicher. Naja. Hm. Ja, nehmen wir das dritte. Why were you in my apartment? Officer? Just doing Mr. Clare small, a small favor. Mr. Everett asked me to get your door open. I figured I'd take a look around while I was at it. Ja, das heißt, wir müssen das mit dem Clare so oder so sagen. So you work for Everard Clare? Officer, please tell him we're good. No, no. Tell him I'll make it up to him. Ah, yeah. What have I done? He'll send the muscle after me. Really? I don't even know what it was about. I just opened the door. Yeah, I don't know what it was. But he doesn't like you. Try not to shit yourself, Gary. <laughs> it's just an open door. Oh, grimly. Our discussion on this topic is over, Gary. Hmm. What could it be about? I Ish. probably talked too loud in the whirling about some theories I had. Whatever it is, I'm done with it. Das will ich doch hoffen. I won't do it again. If there's anything I can do to assist you, or the Union, just ask, okay? I'll try to help if I can. Mm. This scared him proper. He's positively melting from fear. Has to prop himself up with a lot of anger to keep it together. The weather vane has turned. He cannot be unturned. He clearly liked his squirming. He may even have changed his mind about the whole door opening operation. Er war gar nicht dabei. Das haben wir gemacht. You were surprised to see. Okay, warte mal. Scared him with the apartment. Okay, ich wusste, dass er helfen würde. You were surprised to see Michael. Ich bin mir ziemlich sicher, dass wir das schaffen müssen, um herauszufinden, wo die Rüstung ist. Er hat sicherlich einen Teil der Rüstung einfach an. He was surprised to see my colleague, Lieutenant Kitsuragi. Not many Seolites here, or anywhere, other than Seol. I meant no offense, truly. Do you Yorker. remember how when we met Measure Head and I said the next races will be a really good one? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I think so. Sorry, as you know, I've been having problems with my memory. Well, this is that racist. Are you, Gary? Are you a racist? I don't know. I like the previous racists better. <laughs> He's nothing compared to Mesh Head. <laughs> um, egal was wir sagen, wir machen uns lustig über ihn, das finde ich gut. Um, Definitiv nothing compared to Measure Head. I don't know who that is, but all I meant was there are not many Seolites around here. Mm, the lieutenant is a native of Revershall. Yes, what are they doing in that sale of their scheming? Uh, macht das den Dings, macht das den Kitsuragi grantig auf mich, wenn ich sowas sage? Do you have a problem? Um, 
Ach, können wir da freier was weiß? No, no problem at all. Ja, das sagen sie alle. Okay, wollen wir die Composure Probe machen oder wir machen folgendes. Wir machen mal Thank you for Cooperation. Äh, gehen in unser Inventar und schauen, ob wir Composure mal was raufkriegen in irgendeiner Form. Wir haben ein Intact Ding. Was denn? White and Anvil? Nein. Was ist neu? White Anvil of a Stamp Cash Diapa. Nein, das ist der Brief von Everett. Das Yellow Man Mark, hatten wir das vorher schon im Intag? Oder? Naja. Weiß ich nicht. Okay, wir brauchen Composure. Schauen wir mal. Wir haben schon so viel Zeug, irgendwas von dem wir hier wohl Composure raufbringen, oder? Ah, da, Composure plus one, minus ein, zwei, war fair. Gut. Interfacing. Ähm. Okay, das war's. Mehr, mehr Composure kriegen wir nicht. Fürchte ich. Always a pleasure to see. I mean, officers. Ja. Das will ich doch auch. So, 42% der Chance. Acht oder besser müssen wir würfeln. Schauen wir mal. That shirt looks very uncomfortable. Wir sind so, wir sind Look so at the gut. Barely keeping that thing together. As if something is ready to rip out from underneath. This massive muscle which uh, something worn underneath it. Yes, like a piece of ceramic armor, for example. One that makes a clicking sound when the plates meet each other, resembling pearls or marbles, stolen from the corpse in the yard near where he lives. Yes, we look good. We have we have the rüstung, an entire rüstung before. I see you're a connoisseur of high quality combat here. I knew you'd figure it out, officer. I'm sorry I didn't tell you at once. I was... Mm -hmm. I was ashamed of what I did. And I didn't want you to know. Yes, deswegen hat er auch das Zeug dann weggeworfen, weil er hat den danach... Möglicherweise war das die Kleidung noch drauf irgendwie und hat ihm danach das... Ach. We're not detecting falsehood, sire. He's gearing up to admit the truth. Danke, Drama. This shame is surprisingly sincere. Gary, what's going on? Gar nichts, Morel. Such weiter deine Festplatte. Later, Morel. I've got apologizing to do. No, you've got explaining to do. Why did you re-put those clothes fresh? Everyone was picking those pieces off him and I was watching them do it. And they'd scattered his clothes all over the yard. Everything was smelling. So I went there to take out the trash and started cleaning up. All those rags on the ground, him swinging up there and... I had a lapse of honor, sir. I thought, he's a foreigner. They all say he wasn't from here. Mm -hmm. Only the caress was left, so I stripped it off him. It was early in the morning. No one saw me. I took it with me. It was a mistake. Had I known it would give you guys trouble, I, I wouldn't have... Fuck. Yeah. We're detecting sincere contrition here, sire. He's not trying to flatter anyone. It's okay. It was a loose end, and you are tying it up now. I'm so fucking sorry I called you yellow man. Oh, CRI okay. officers commanded the suzerain's navy. Most of them sided with the king when... They were thoroughly conservative men, he realizes suddenly. 
It's difficult to say what the lieutenant thinks of this historic apology. <laughs> His face does not belie emotions. I'm not sure if he Give him the armor now. Why did you lie to me, Gary? Naja, gut, das brauche ich echt nicht fragen. Das ist einem offensichtlich peinlich. You know who killed the hanged man. I always thought it was the Union, but I sure as hell won't go around saying that anymore. You have my word. I don't know, and I won't be running my mouth on this subject anymore. Ah, deswegen, weil er gemeint hat, die Union war's. Und das dürften die anderen Typen gehört haben und deswegen sollten die das... Ach, this is all he knows. Mm. Give me the armor now. He sighs again, hangs his head and unbuttons his shirt fully. A cuirass that matches the dead man's boots comes into view. Soon it is in your hands, smelling of his sweat. Auch nicht schlecht. Können wir auch noch anziehen, bin ich mir ziemlich sicher. But so, so light to hold. Like a bag of cotton. Hmm. Are we done here, Gary? Yes, absolutely. I will never do anything like this again. Wir sind so großartig. Wir sind die besten Detectives ever. Thank you for your cooperation. Wir sind die ab. Wir schauen uns die Rüstung an. Fairweather T500 Cuirass, plus 1 auf Pain Threshold und plus 1 auf Volition, aber minus 1 auf Empathy. Mainly of Vulnerability, Borrowed Confidence, Thicker Skin. This vitreous animal cuirass fits snugly and re re redistributes kinetic energy across its Amazingly, it fits under your coat, and it also makes pretty porcelain sound when shaking. Okay, das heißt, wir können es statt dem Shirt anziehen, nehme ich mal an. Tatsache. Das Shirt macht plus eins Logic. Ah, wir sind super, wir ziehen den Kurs an. Und noch ein Punkt mehr. Wir haben so viele Skill Points. Ich überlege mir gerade. Ähm, ich überlege mir gerade, dass wir noch einen Punkt in Endurance nehmen. Einfach deshalb, weil das einen Lebenspunkt mehr bringt. Hm. Werden wir machen. Und das ist definitiv etwas, was uns fehlt. Traps, okay, gut. Yes. So ein Vier. Okay, meine lieben Herrschaften. Ähm, ich hoffe, es geht euch gut. Das hat fallen. Schauen wir noch da hinten das grüne Zeug an. Was ist das? Could this be the glass you told you about? Ich weiß es nicht. A metal and plastic contraption oh, bobs up and down amidst oh. the trembling reeds. Also, doch noch mal At Text first, before we it aufhören. just looks like trash. <laughs> but if you look closer. That over there must be the boy class you told us about. The one she hid her passport in. We should take a look. Ah, das ist schon ewig her, dass sie uns das erzählt Ooh, hat. Hidden things, secrets, lies. Danke, Drama. Wir hätten Drama nicht so stark machen sollen. Das hat zu viele yes. Erfolge. Spindling extremities have been here. Snap the cords keeping the boy in place. A little longer and it will be floating somewhere out in the open sea. What? Enough. It's just rapid movement across the water. It leaves no trace. A whisper. Damn, I felt really strange just now. We're lucky it's still here. A little longer and it would have floated away. Indeed. Let's see what's inside. Mm, pick up the boy. The boy is not tied to anything. The cords dangling from the bottom really have been torn or cut. 
You lift it out of the water easily, noticing how light it is. Ah, oh, the quartz tangy. Ah, oh, this is. Es ist aufgeschnitten worden. Das heißt, möglicherweise ist gar nichts mehr drinnen. The number 11 has been written on the yellow plastic. It hasn't been in the water for very long, but it's already discolored and slimy with silt. A latch holds it close, but only just barely. The brittle metal of the latch has cracked. Simple construction. Very unsafe. There's something in there. Splashing around. Sniff the boy. It smells like you would expect it to smell. A concentrated version of the coast. Salt, industrial slop and decay. Ja, dann öffnen. A shot glasses worth of seawater pours out. Some algae. And nothing else. Well, damn. No documents. You, who do you think took them? I have no idea. Hmm, this is a minor quirk. We know what was in the boy anyway. Or think we do. This is a small loose end, either way. Not important, I hope. We must have it must have been Classia's enemies, which means he's in, maybe Classia took them herself. Could this be related to the cryptozoologists plan? I have no um That may very well be the case. We should keep an eye on her. Uh, nothing more for us to do here. Let's go. You could ask the miss what she thinks later, if you have the time. Though you doubt she'll tell you much at this point. Damn, I felt really strange just now. Mm -hmm. Gut, aber jetzt machen wir wirklich Schluss, meine Damen, meine Herren. Ich wünsche einen schönen Abend. Bis dann. Ciao.